Hey, it's Cam from Titania, and today we have a video of the HTC Sensation 4G. We've got some benchmark testing today. We're going to test four main benchmarking tools, plus one other one I've just added in, but four main ones, Linpack, Quadrant, and Tutu, and also Neocore. So, this is the Sensation 4G, if you don't know what I'm talking about. It's a pretty nice new Android device, available on T-Mobile in the USA, many carriers in Europe, and on Bell Mobility in Canada. So we can just go over here. So we can do Linpack first. And I have, just to show you, closed all of the applications in the background. So we can run a single thread. And we got 43 mflops. 45 mflops. And... 45 mflops. That's about what I've been getting between 45, 46 maybe. So that is the single thread, and now we will run a multi-thread. 67. 69. And 65. I have broken 70 before, but this is about where the area where I'm getting. So that is Linpack. Now we can do a quadrant standard test. Uh, 2035. That's a pretty great score, not quite up to the Galaxy S2's crushing 3000 that it's been getting on some tests, but this is a pretty great score. It doesn't really represent what the phone actually does in terms of how smooth it is, but it is a pretty good benchmark score. So, now we can run Antutu. Here we go on Antutu. Go to test. Start test. Tutu, getting a very nice 4,561 for a score. I'll just zoom in here. You can take a look at the individual scores for the other different sections of the test. Pretty great score on Antutu, and now we're going to move on to Neocore. So Neocore is a Qualcomm testing application. As you can see, it says Qualcomm there. We can just jump in. Well, you will run a benchmark. And here we go with the cool music. Bam, 59.7 frames per second. Pretty solid, I've gotten 60.4 before, but mainly around the 59 range, but a very nice score for Neocore. So, now we can just run the final one, which is Monjori, which does a shader test. second. Pretty nice. So overall, the benchmark tests on this phone, it does pretty well. Nothing like Galaxy S2, amazing, but it does pretty well on benchmarks. And how much do benchmarks really matter, right? It's a lot more about the real user experience. So I will have more videos coming soon of the HTC Sensation. But for now, thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you feel like it. And I will see you in the next video.
and Cam for Titania doing the benchmark tests on the HTC Sensation 4G.